You don't just snap your fingers and become DA. Uh, that's a that's a, an elected office. You've got to campaign. You got to hire a staff, and you got to make speeches. You got to find endorsements. And even if I did all that, there's no certainty that I'd actually get the job. Yeah, but it would be easier if you were out of the way, right? You didn't answer my question. How badly do you want Willis's job? Answer me. Having that kind of power to make real change, that's my dream. Like, I haven't been doing this lawyer thing very long, but I'll tell you what, I hate getting the bad guy off. Oh, come on. That's ridiculous. It's an oversimplification. Not every one of your clients is Annie Chandler. If you want, you could easily concentrate on people you believe mm, in. No, 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 no. It's really, it's about being the prosecutor. How so? It's being the bulldog to take down the bad guy. <laughs> and I'll tell you what, throughout Annie Chandler's trial, I'm watching D.A. Willis and I'm thinking to myself, I want his job. Oh, why is And I'll tell you what, if I did have his job, the outcome would have been totally different. Adam Chandler would have never gotten that double jeopardy over on me. Wow. What, too cocky? <laughs> For you? Never. <laughs> Just lately, I feel like I find out something new about you every day. For instance, I had no idea you were so passionate about the law. Oh, really? You thought it was just the billable hours? Maybe. Yes, the money's very nice. But I want more than that. Really? But you want justice? What's fair? You keep in mind one thing. You use those photos. You're not just destroying a man's job. You're destroying his life. Is that what you call justice? Any more questions? No, sir. You'll have to come with us. Uh, what for? Give me a sec. I'm gonna get you a good lawyer, make sure you have immunity. But why do I have to go with the police? Because they need you to make a statement so they know what really happened. You help me, I'm gonna help you. Everything's gonna be fine. Thank you. We gotta go. Hey, hey, listen, just uh, let me say something. I just wanna say something, okay? Kendall, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. I am, I'm sorry. I'm sure that doesn't mean a damn thing to you right now, but... It's just not the way I wanted it to go down. Okay, you're right about a lot of things. I, I, I've lost it, and I haven't been the same since Greenlee died. You uh, ran her off the road. And I can't forgive you for that. And I wanted to make you see my hurt and how much I'm hurt. I'm sorry for this, okay? I'm sorry. Whatever happens to me, it's fine. Because I'm just fed up with Pine Valley anyway. It's too much you know what drama. I'm fed up with you. You can go to prison. Spend the yeah. rest of your days there. And just see how bad everything could be. Fine. You okay? I'd like you to follow us downtown. For what I thought we're done here. Yeah, I'm gonna need an official statement from both of you. It can wait. Uh, Mrs. Slater's been a few Mrs. Slater has been through a lot. She needs a break now. I understand, but technically okay. she's still... Do me a favor. Call Jesse Hubbard, Pine Valley Police Department. He's a friend of mine. they will understand. And we're leaving. Come on. No, forget it. No presents are being opened on Christmas Eve. We have to wait until Christmas morning and that is final. Yeah? Well, we'll see about that. What if on Christmas Eve I get you good and loaded on eggnog and you go down for the count and I wake up Trevor? You wouldn't dare. Yeah, I would. And then we open all the presents. We go bananas. We play with everything, right? And then when he gets tired, I put him back to sleep. I come downstairs, I wrap all the presents, I put them under the Christmas tree. And when you wake up in the morning, you wouldn't even know what happened. Hello? All right, you try it and see what happens. For starters, you will not get your present, which I happen to have right here. Oh, yeah? Good. Oh, well, that's weird. What, you don't know whether to give me the gold watch or, uh-oh, the DVD collector's edition of Todos Los Niños, my favorite telenovela. Oh, yeah, I didn't you. buy this one. It's, uh, it's a present to Trevor from David. 